some reason. <laughs> Where's it gone? Where's it got welcome? Uh, Friday's Spain play for everyone. When the last time we did the week, probably. Um, well, this went smooth. Yeah, I've just uh, started a server on to play on, but it looks like uh, Tusk switching hell has just in, happened in the cloud. So I might have to, I'm going to try and reset this. Let's, let's reset this. Because that, um, it's weird. I think it's because I resized the actual uh, server browser window there. And it might have uh, caused it to uh, to trip up, so we'll, we'll try again. <clears throat> Is it wrap up? Wrap up. How's it going, Sean? You're right. And to all you guys, the listener, welcome, and to the guys who joining later or uh, afterwards as well. Um, you know, thank you guys for watching and supporting. If you give a like on the video and if you share it out, it helps tremendously with engagement. It helps tremendously with um, you know finding new subscribers as well. So. Uh, I would appreciate that. I think we're almost in. What? I mean, last night when I came offline, I, I watched the um, uh, AMD um, video on the, the new Ryzen uh, or the Zen 3 architecture CPU. Uh, really impressive stuff, especially the stats that were on the back of the screen and the new records it's been setting now. This actually... Um, so first of all, I'd say this is probably a turning point for them in the, the CPU space in direction now of the hardcore gamers. Um, for a long time, if you've uh, been a gamer on GPU, you've effectively like, um, what's, what gives me the best performance if I combine the two together? Depending on budget and stuff, yes, but if you truly wanted the fastest uh, performance and you needed the highest IPC per core, instructions per clock core, um, performance for games to really sort of um, uh, shine for you. That has always been, well, not always, not always, always. I, I, I swear to God, when I had a K62 and then an Athlon CPU way back when, it actually was faster than the current Intel counterpart at the time. It felt like, it definitely felt like it in games. And uh, of course, running uh, game servers as well at high FPS. LAN parties that that really did actually um, hit LAN parties like they still think and uh, it just it was a time where they you know with a 64-bit structure say it was a time of arrival and yeah we can do this but then they just the whole FX line they fell behind and they fell behind a, a lot what the hell's going on here just let's go for an official you just like stop downloading the mods for a second that's that could you know could very well be it. I'm gonna make sure I launch without the mods because all I was looking for is a is a the high pop one, which usually there's one or two of them. I I need to unsubscribe from all that probably. It could quite possibly be causing this thing to actually uh, upend itself. But let me just um let's try and resize this window again. I'm just going to um second guys, I'm just gonna find the lowest the lowest ping with the the high play account is is what I'm looking for here. That is perfect. So this is Chinaris Plus. It looks like it's in the daytime. I'm just gonna try and load in. So keep current selection and join. We don't need any mods for this. And I'm gonna leave it alone a second. Just let me boot the game up before I switch over the screen. That could possibly be something that's going in there. What's, what's up, Roger, how are you doing? So yeah, the the uh, stats are truly impressive. You've got, um, You've got a 32 megabyte cache on that CPU that is now accessible from all parts of it. And I think, uh, I think it might have delivery. Please. Hold on, this will, this will interrupt things. Yeah, it is here, one second. I'll have to get this. I'll uh, let you know in a second, sure. How that is. Maybe it's not here. It's not here. Anyway, so now the uh, Zen Zen Three's got uh, thirty-two megabyte of uh, onboard cache, which is shared between all the cores, and they can um, you know access that independently for a great speed boost. But the important thing is here is the IPC count of the CPU. When you take a core and isolate it, this is for gaming. When you take an, and this is what it was all about. You take that individual core and and uh, the amount of structures it could pass through to get a certain gigahertz rate. It gives you a boost in most games. You get a you get a boost. That is that is where 
Zen has still been slightly behind. Not on multi-core applications, not when you're editing, not when you're, uh, you know, rendering. That's been like great value for money. It's like phew, Intel have been being kicked in that, that regard. They've been really struggling to keep up. But now it should translate into the benchmarks for games to say, look, we can give you a competitive processor. And the pricing was actually aggressive too. Aggressive in the upward thing. In other words, saying that, you know, we don't mind our processors being this expensive now because truly they take you on. You know, they're going to give you, um, you know, the performance that you, you kind of want from AMD. So great news. Really, really great news. I've just, I've got to congratulate that because Intel have had it very, very easy the last few years. And Zen has been snapping at their heels. And it's really, really good to see AMD in this position to bring it. It's very, very important. Because that'll force Intel to make a move now. And hopefully we'll have cat and mouse game over the next few years, pushing things faster and better, and we're getting more for our money, hopefully. Fingers crossed. But no, it really is because the, the top end part, what's 16? Is it 16? Cool, 32 threads. That's a monster. Spe you know, especially all those calls working faster. So, you know, I think any one of those parts, and, uh, you know, it depends if you're not overclocking, we'll see. 4.9 gigahertz, though. 4.9 gigahertz. Why couldn't it be in 5? I always want more, but why couldn't it be 5 gigahertz? Why couldn't Zen 3 be, like, the 5 gigahertz part? I bet it overclocks the 5 gigahertz. I bet there's a little bit of a headroom there. I bet you could, I bet you could clock that. Anyway, we're, we're back to uh, square one, my uh, tin of tuna. And I'm hungry, and I'm going to need to have to find something to break this open, but... Hell no, which way are we going here? I guess up here we'll do. And apparently I've got to stop running. Oh, but we're just going to have a little jog. Also, let's not forget that they showed off uh, some benchmarks from the RDNA 2 based... Um, Radeon 6000, which, uh, yeah, that looks to be in competitive territory. Did they release the specs of the top card, though? What 6000 series card are we talking about here? Is it the medium base card? If it's the medium base card, then we're on for some game on here. I mean, in a, in a few weeks, would it be possible that they have the fastest CPU and the fastest graphics card? I'm dying to see what ray tracing capabilities it has. You know, like utilizing DXR, but how does it do more efficiently? Does it not? It's a, it's a difficult time. Now, regarding my graphics card, I've got a 3080 on pre-order. And that's what I'm waiting for. Once I get that, then I'm, I'm fully back in action. But if they can't make them fast enough... And that whole Ryzen thing sort of comes to fruition. It starts getting close. I might be tempted to, you know, well, well, I doubt it shouldn't take that long. You know, I'm, I'm quite happy with it. But it is, it's great to see. It really is great to see. It sounds to me like there's going to be some real competition, I think, in the graphics space. But this, well, the CPU space, there is. There's no doubt. The figures that they posted, uh, you know, setting the record in the Cinebench... It's like a, it's like a mark in the sand, really, because you're basically trying to, you know, trying to come on in, come on Intel, bring it on with your next chip. The interesting thing is the actual architecture, of the um, the node size. I mean, you got like what, AMD running on seven nanometer, Intel are still running on around about fourteen with some of their CPUs on ten. But the argument is always there that that Intel's act, you know, Intel's uh, fourteen and ten are actually. S as small as some of the sevens. It, it, it's it's a complicated argument, this one. But we'll see. We'll see that, you know, have Intel lost Christmas? Have Intel lost 2021 uh, to Zen 3? Is it actually... Are we talking about a genuine monster CPU with even more IPC count, which, you know, means better game performance for us gamers? Because that, that's where the fight is. You could put 128 cores on a CPU. 128 threads, 64 cores. Oh yeah. Zen has that. But it's not going to make... It's not going to... Your gaming performance is probably not going to be as good with a, a core with less processors and high gigahertz count. 
So let, let's see Zen 3 come out with a very easy overclock on the motherboard to 5 gigahertz. It seems so close. I mean, they, they've already stated that apparently it'll set new records all over. You know, people are going to push these things to the limit. But hopefully 5 gigahertz doesn't require liquid nitrogen. Maybe just an all-in-one cooler. All right, I need that nice hat. Exciting. I really... I got that. I connected with that... Um, as all these uh, these these shows are, you know, the audience isn't there, but they're talking to the mass audience uh, streaming it, and uh, it, it was, yeah, it's really good, really. I I, I wanted this. I wanted this. I, I'm a a fanboy of performance. You know, I, I really couldn't care if you know arms suddenly step in and say, "Look, we've just created the." Uh... Damn! Have you ever wondered? When you look at the power of these mobile devices at the moment, the resolution that their screens run at. What the hell? Is it stuck? Hold on. Hold on. Please don't crash. The Banes of integrated GPUs. Please don't. One, one sec. I'm just going to refresh this display. I found a trick to get around it. Now I need to refresh chat as well. Hold on. Refresh chat. Yes, it's active again. Refresh stream. That's kind of my fault because I didn't... Uh, I didn't look all the way to the left on the other screen to see if the video was actually moving. <laughs> it was not. Right, we should be good now. Sorry about that. You just have to imagine me, uh, I don't know, I climbed up a deer stand over there, you know what I mean? But my chat was also paused. Oh, I couldn't see what you said. Hold on. We got a call here. Hello? Hello. Oh, really? Oh, tax four case, you say? Ah. A warrant. Arrested shortly. Damn, they work fast. You got any other more bullshit you want to tell me? You want me to press one and connect to a call for 150 at about 10 pound a minute? Is that what you want me to do? Yeah, you hang up. Hey, what that prank call, man? Prank call. My name is Brian. This is human. Well, it didn't say that, but it's the same voice that I happen to have on the stream. It said, "This is his Ma Her Majesty's tax and revenue." Press 1 to pay the uh, tax revenue bill and, uh, you know, oh, BS. Because we have a fraud, fraudulent case against you, and if you do not do this, then, you know, we will send the authorities out to you shortly. What the hell, man? My god. The way people try and make something is basically the way you don't know where that's coming. What's this? Tell me someone's left a tin opener in here. That's all I need is a tin opener. Anything in the barrel? Open sesame. There you go. Uh, there's nothing in it, but I'll tell you what, I'll leave that. See if someone keep the head warm. I can't convert it anyway, so. That's a good place. <sighs> Where was I? Right, just so I can make sure I'm catching up with chat. Hold on. Any word, a new graphics card. So let's start there because that's the last... <laughs> apart from the Roger claps. That's the last thing I, could, I actually saw on my screen until I reset both. Right, the graphics card. So I think I answered that in kind of part of what I was talking about. It's on pre-order. 
the reason why I've decided to hopefully ride this out for maybe a couple more weeks or I don't know hopefully not months depending on what's available is because um, well to be honest who knows what's going on because I still haven't received a call back uh, I was going to get one in three days uh, apparently arranging this um, uh, this refund so anyway what I've done is I pre-ordered a, a 3080 um, not a founders I've gone for a a third party card but it's all right because it's um it run cooler run about 10 degrees cooler actually which is pretty insane right slow down stop running so fast i have itchy terrible habit shift finger because i've played daisy for so long and i always run about this one we can't do that so much so really eke it out especially when i've got that much food i'm on the way down health wise I need to find uh, anything, anything with an edge we can dig into that tin. Damn, this is difficult. But I'll try and make it work again. <clears throat> so, uh, ETA, I don't know. The reason why I chose to pre-order this was basically I could not get the same... 20, uh, the found of the position 28 Ti anymore. They just don't make them. Nobody sells them. Um, I. It's not a bad thing, really. It, it was calculated risk. I, I don't know. Um, but uh, I decided not to try and acquire one on, uh, via eBay and try and get one with a warranty. Um, also, I, I can't put eBay through the tax system uh, at least I'm not. I don't think so. So I've I've gone for that in the pre-order. It's actually cheaper than the previous card I got, which I I guess you'd say is a bit of a bonus. But um, I don't know if I'm going to get it yet. It, depending on demand and see see if I can articulate it. I'm just I'm just going to make do for as long as I can get an equivalent high performance card. 2080 Ti's ties are still more money to purchase than well some people are selling them for the same price put it this way as they were two years ago and you know you can get a faster card you just have to wait for it so i kind of figured there's not a whole load of new releases yet i don't want to miss the release of cod um I'm abs i've actually been i've been super itching to play um warzone i've been watching some uh Dr. Disrespect and Zelena play some tournament matches. I've seen a couple of those. And it made me feel like, you know, I really just want to get into that again. I can't find that on a cloud service, unfortunately. There is Apex. But neither... There is Battlefield, but I'd have to uh, plug in the controller. I, I could. I could. I might, I might do that next stream. I might do it later. I don't, I don't know. Which processor did I go for? Um, I, this is not a new build. This is not a new computer build. This is just a, I had a failure of the graphics card fan control or temperature control. And that's the only component I intend on replay. I've actually got to run in here. What am I doing? Let's, let's make sure we pick up something sharpie. I've got the knife. Let's open this up. Concentrate a little bit on my healthy. <laughs> we plan on surviving this. I'm going to take this inside to eat because I've just heard gunshots. Makes it a little bit more fruity and interesting. This server is apparently almost full. Just like every game before it, I've played on a... on a random public server with vanilla rules. I'm, I'm up for the challenge here. That's where I'm taking this. I, I could have gone onto another server with lots of guns and stuff, but I'm just going to try it for the challenge. I keep getting a little kick every time I get a little bit further, you know, managing this better. My only downfall is probably I've been running everywhere like a nutter. But I need to slow down and, and not do that until I've got plentiful supply of food. Which this game in this mode is not going to give me. I think the other thing that was put, put to me yesterday was... 
well, you know, don't don't bother going onto a larger server if you're not doing so well on on a server with hardly any players on. That's not the case. It's not. I I re, I'll counter that argument saying that the more people you've got on the server, the more scarce the resources become when you go into some of these places. Just like now, it's already open. People have already been there, and it's less likely you're going to find you know what you want as quick as you want. So so actually, it's it's not quite like that. It's not. I don't think I've died much because of skill level. I've just unfortunately not been able to find you know what I need quick enough. With a knife, we could cut some... I can make a fire. I can make a bow drill. We were at that stage just by finding a kitchen knife. We could get a chicken, which I actually heard uh, just before. So food would be okay. Water supplies, another thing. I mean, apparently you can drink from wells and you don't... I don't think you get a disease from it. So we might as well fill up here. I didn't last time anyway, so... You will from him, though, if he uh, strikes you. Right, so I'm told to hold this down until a separate symbol comes up saying you're absolutely full. So I'm going to do that this time. Oh crap, no I'm not, because this dude's going to have a go. Take this guy out first. Get down. So I haven't gone from a new processor, though. No. Um, yeah, it's, it's not the... Not the easiest of times, so not the best time for me to um, go that far. I, I, I'm i running at an 8700K um, at uh, 4.7 gigahertz on all cores. It runs super cool. Um, unless... I don't know. You know, if, if you buy a next generation card and it's like... I, I'm down 20 FPS because the CPU is bottlenecked. You know, you need to upgrade the motherboard because you need like definitely need PCIe 4 and you definitely need this. I mean, technically this all runs off of one NVMe. I've got a couple in there, but it... I'm not really saturating the bus, put it this way. Will a 3080 uh, do it with uh, NVMe? I don't know, it's, it's debatable. I, I haven't... I guess I'd have to compare new Ryzen benchmarks with the graphics card I intend to get and see what the difference is. If we're talking percentage points of 20 more percent out of your graphics card, well, then it's time to actually think about upgrading, yes. Right, my health is on the rise. That's good. Blood's on the rise. <laughs> I need some more food. <laughs> Where's that chicken? How's it going, Aguntus? You right? Welcome back, man. I hope it's working fine for everyone. I'm, I'm, it says it's got 60 FPS. I've got a good bit rate. Wow, this is still going. I was expecting some kind of sim. I really don't want to make my character sick necessarily. Because I'm, I'm in kind of good health. But I'm not seeing any other symbol come up yet by... I oh, there we go. Okay. That's the first time I've seen that. And now it's gone away. Right, I get you. First time seeing that symbol. So there's a little... It, it flashed up for a little bit. As if I was... Jesus. As if I was on the edge. That, that's good. This chat gone crap again. One second. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Canopus. Welcome back. One, one for to see it. I don't know what's going on with that. I've literally... I've got a Chrome browser. I'm on studioyoutube.com. I've got the preview of the stream. I've chat all in the same window, and chat keeps uh, stalling. It, it doesn't even come up with a timeout message. It just stops. I had to do last stream. I had to refresh it maybe five, six times during the stream just to catch up. I'm not sure what's going on there, and it's like timing out. It used to come up with a message that it timed out. So I'm, I'm not quite sure what's going on there. Change of shoes is always nice. These are ones you get by default, and not always the best. But welcome back. It has been a while. But let's see the review sites get hold of it and uh, start comparing it with graphics cards. I mean, I just, I do want to see it. I want to see it. 
I got I got no hate for these companies. I just I want to see it. I want to see progress. I want to see Zen 2. And I want to see the graphics card as well. I want to see 100 percent I want to see RDNA 2. Go hang on a second. Here you go, NVIDIA. We've actually got a card that does this. And do you know what I actually want to see? I want to see uh this is pushing pushing it a bit. I want to see AMD's implementation of ray tracing outperform NVIDIA's RTX. I want to see it. Because it depends how much importance you pl you you put on uh, ray tracing. I suppose... I don't know if AMD would do this. I think it's about... I, I, yeah, I don't, I don't know how AMD are actually technically achieving this compared to NVIDIA. But you got, you know, you've got a certain amount of silicon on, on chip and then you've got RT cores on there, which are taking up a certain about amount of bandwidth. You're, you know, and that's doubled in this latest generation from Nvidia's side. I don't know how AMD are achieving their implementation of DXR. I'm not sure how it works. But if it was to work anything the same, then it's like, well, okay, let's do a really high end enthusiast card with ray tracing, but let's do a high enthusiast card without ray tracing, and more cause for for that purpose you know using that space and it's almost like a non-ray tracing card you know uh, granted to nvidia though they've taken a lot of risk they've you know especially you know people like me who bought the first generation well it's okay it's pretty good ray tracing dlss2 on on uh death stranding was absolutely amazing you know, that tech, there's technology there, which is like, you know, AI technology there, which uh, makes the image look even better than it was intended in full settings. You know, small details really came out of that. That, again, is impressive. That's like, well, okay, you th there's some of the stuff's real good you paid for. But the ray tracing is always sort of, I look at that 2080 Ti and think, well, the ray tracing is on there. But you knew it. You knew when you bought into that technology, it's going to look damn good, but it's going to be at one hefty performance penalty. And that's kind of... That's now at acceptable levels in the in the latest generation. But I, I really want to know, because the information might be out there somewhat, but I, I'm not quite sure how it compares. Like, because it's in the latest consoles, right? It's in the PS5, it's in the, the new Xbox. They're capable of doing ray tracing. But I'm not sure technically how they do it different from NVIDIA's implementation. Is it different? Maybe it's the same. But I, I'm just... They they all have their own names for things. So I don't have to update myself on that if that information is actually available. I don't, I don't know. Right, I'm going to replace this hiking backpack because this one's a better one. Stunnik, welcome. Devo, welcome. How you guys doing? You guys seen the, uh, did you watch the stream? Ryzen uh, stream? Tell me what you think. Seen it. Another chem light. Notice I am jogging it. I'm jogging it. I'm taking it easier today. Uh, kind of still a bit, a, a little bit iffy. Um, you pr might be able to hear it. I'm still a little bit, you know, got it a little bit, but um, I don't think it's, uh, I think it's more just a general cold. It doesn't feel like, um, it doesn't really match with anything. Uh, corona. That to be safe, uh, like this morning, I helped my, uh, helped my dad take his van in and Driving back was a four. Oh, guys. I, <laughs> first time I've driven a, a, another car. Another car since uh, the EV um, today, this morning. Um, yeah, it's a huge difference, I noticed very quickly. Uh, especially as I was joining the dual carriageway. <laughs> it's interesting when you put a foot down on a, a turbo diesel. The, the lag, you're just so used to it, but I wasn't, <laughs> I pressed it, and it was like, what? You know, and that's for any EVs, just got that, 
It's got that instant torque. It doesn't matter if it's a race car or it's a standard one. A any of them just have that kind of... Oh, nice shoes. I've got to take them. They just have that. Shoes, do they actually make a difference in this game? But is there a durability? Because I would assume that hiking boots are the one we should use. But, you know, look smart with sneakers. Does it actually make a difference to anything like calorie burn or anything? Or, or does one have better endurance than the other? I feel like I'm putting items on, you know. It's like um, getting buffed in in uh, World of Warcraft or something. Because it has like X Hex spell on there or something. Like plus one. Plus one journey buff. What's up, Rob? Thinking about abandoning Intel next time. It's time for an upgrade. The 5 Series Ryzen seems to take the lead in the race. Yes, it does. We've just got to wait. I mean, it's coming out soon. We've just got to wait for it to get in the hands of the major reviewers. Watch a few videos. And try and absorb this marvel that's happening. Because it's been so many years. If you've got like a secret bit of A&D and hit, you know, man, I, 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 admit, I slashed them a bit as well because I was always disappointed generation after generation and really not competitive on price here. But when you, when you paid a lot for a graphics card, it was like, well, I can't get everything out on this platform. I want to support you, but you know, 50 bucks more and I'm getting the most up. It was, um, it was always a decision like that. So it's good to see. So I would I would totally agree with you. At the moment in my heart, I would say next year, if I could do it, I would definitely go the Ryzen route. If it proves itself and Intel have no competition for it at the same price, because then you've got to consider it, right? If, if they bring out something straight away that's you know, super competitive, if it's cheaper or the same price, I'd go for it. If it makes a frame or two difference in the actual result, hell. AMD, you got me. Great job with the effort. Let's see what happens. I mean, that that could actually be said for the graphics card as well. I'm a, I'm a massive Team Green fan because that's been the same same again. It, it, you to be at the highest end, they've always kind of had that edge. But now you've got AMD who are both the next gen generation consoles. A lot of development work there from both sides. Is it enough to take on the 3080? I just, I wondered if tactically you'd try a different skew like that. Because they, they do pretty well despite not having ray tracing. And it's like if you do two cards and let the vote be cast by the actual high end, you know. Do you want a card that's got ray tracing on or do you want a card that's just got dedicated performance for more, push more frames out in general? graphics or as AMD totally accepted that ray tracing is a must we need to make a fire now let's go make a fire uh, this shots that way so I'm going to head up top of here and wait a second is that some reflection up there or someone I think it is someone else burning a fire or something but Let's make a fire. As long as I keep at this pace, then we should be okay. I'm dropping health, but I'm not completely out yet. So peaceful out here. Apart from the odd um, blastage. try and make something of it here. Uh, cut tree. Let's do a proper one. Oh, wow. My health is... Uh, yeah, okay. Let's uh, cut the bark off now. One 
piece. Good. Now I need some sticks. Let's cut this bush. Alright, that's going to come with two... Really? That turned into like two pieces, giant pieces of wood. Do these stack? Alright, hell. Let's put the, um... Let's do the fire here. But I'm going to need... Need... Some branches. Yeah, now I just need long sticks, which I think... Well, those would be good for the... We can create the bow drill with, so one second. My place. Next recipe. And drill kit, that's the one. That's true, my hands are dirty, but... I think probably priority at the moment is to eat. And now we can light the fire. Well, this is where the two logs are, so if we put that together with that, we should be able to create fireplace. Well, it's certainly, there is certainly an art to that. That is for sure. Right, fireplace. Let's put that just here. Hold. No. Right, I'm trying to choose placement. Is it right click or something? Yeah. No? Hold right? No. Hold left? No. Click. One click? No. What is wrong with this uh, area then? Damn, I can't place it, guys. What am I doing wrong here? Choose placement. Press. I can see it on the ground. Click left mouse button, it goes away. Hold left mouse button, it goes away. Right click and then... No, it's not that. G. Does it usually turn like green when you put it down or does it stay white there? Hey, does it really have to be that flat? Really? Oh, hold on. Are we talking about like it goes like a lighter white color? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. There. Oh, fuck. would you believe it? That is why. Place it. All right, we're down. Um, where's those logs? Oh, wait a second, that's literally like, wow, okay. Put that down. <laughs> we should be able to make like a large fire, you know? A like bonfire. Get like five logs, make a, a bonfire. Okay, let's take now. Good. That on there, I suppose we can add as it burns. So let's try and light it up. And did I get a large stick out of that or what? Well, I suppose that's what we need. That's the last thing I need here. It's a large stick. Nope, I got a hand drill. So we should be okay there on the bingo. We got hunting skill. 
All right, so we got up. We got our stick. Actually, lots of logs there. I wonder if maybe it's worth putting them in front of the vicinity into there. I think. Here we go. All right, put you down. Well, that, I doubt that's going to fit in the backpack. So we'll down on the ground. Get into our hands and should wait. There's something missing. We need a combustible material, so I'm going to use the damaged rags. That's it. Need a bit of kindling and ignite. Yay. Let's cook us the chicken. Well, this is very easy, isn't it? Probably as you can see the fire a mile off. Hopefully nobody will uh nobody will kill kill a dude who's just trying to just trying to make it work, huh? Just out of the blue, does anyone know how you get your game onto GeForce now? Is the question I'm going to put out there because I could I couldn't find it on search. There must be some way for a developer to actually uh, allow it because there's, there's a particular game called uh, Between the Stars which uh, I tested the demo of but I never played the full game probably. And I asked the developer um, if they would put it on there, and he was wasn't quite sure. Well. I think first time suggested it and and I thought it would be an excellent game to be able to play on there. I could see a forum post to submit requests like, uh, you know, which one you might, might like. Is it worth eating it a baked? I suppose we should really just like eat this one straight. Because we're like super hungry. need more than that by the looks of it. Gives us a nice bit of warmth too in the night time. Yeah, because you know how it's integrated with Steam. I, I wondered if, um, or like a Epic Launcher as well is on there. I wonder if it's something like, um, you know when you submit the game via one of those platforms. Is it like a tick box there to say allow cloud gaming or allow like GeForce Now? I wondered if it was as simple as that. Because when I searched like how do you get your game onto there or how do you submit your game, it really didn't come up with anything useful. You know that that would probably help in people's applications, no? I don't know. Something I randomly came across today while trying to find that out. Because it works so well, though, I, the only thing I will say is my. I think is my screen. No, I think we're good. Yeah, right. Pretty decent. So I've, I've just had two of them. That's what taken us to like half full. We could still eat some more. Um, I think we'll let this burn and move on. I got the stick. I don't think we need anything else at the moment. Unless it's actually make a. Actually, probably a good idea to take some something with us. Look at those light rays. Yeah, now you can see how bright it is from there. It's just like a, a beacon we just lit up. For anyone who's a sneaky bandit sniper. What direction we should go in. It's giving me quite a bit of food, but I can still eat some more. Yep, I have. Um, I played uh, No Man's Sky the other day. 
and uh, I was uh, going for the living ship task, although I kept it sort of on course, and then some people were saying it was a massive wide area and it would randomly appear, you know, stay on that course, and I just uh, apparently, you know, s someone came in a bit bit late and suggested what well, is actually doing some research is actually true you just need to get right onto the exact point there and kind of do a scan around you from that works much better I just was running out of time so end up grabbing lots of crystals instead bank later but yeah that that's a game that I've had since the start and they, they just turned it into virtually a completely it's it's not a different game but you know so fleshed out with like edit I'm not convinced we should go that way maybe up here is better <laughs> maybe up here is like a little uh, I'll, I'll risk it but let's switch the light on I think for the stream it's not good when you've just got it like pitch black, so it's uh yeah, it's bad. This way. Where the hell am I going? You know I feel like I'm going up one of those trails which takes me to the edge of the map. Where is this thing going? Of course that doesn't say. But I got a lot of help from uh, a member of the community jumped on and, and uh, gave uh Gave me and uh, Saint has a, a pretty hefty amount of supplies because he was like a, a really hardcore No Man's Sky player, like someone who goes to the nth degree to collect everything and has uh, travelled far distances, you know. That was really helpful, some of the stuff he's given, so well, I'll, I'll revisit. Kind of keep it within the trees in case we had to dart into them or something. But my food is going down because it's trying to make up for the health loss. You know, it's been drained and we're moving, and it, two chicken legs are just <laughs> chicken. I'd say it's chicken breast, right? The two cuts, chicken breasts are just not enough. Not when you're like almost empty. So there's a couple of things we can do. We can try and get to the edge of one of the towns and see if I can get a couple of chickens to repeat what I've just done and create a fire there. Uh, Rob, I think it's great. Um, I, I logged in I logged into my account uh, just a couple of days ago to test it with a con controller and um, the reports came in from one. So that there, there is, you know, it's active and the new stuff sounds great. It's it's vital that you know you keep the fight up. But the uh, particularly the new anti cheat seems to focus on this recoil control area of things, which um, I've seen for such a long time. You know what I mean? That there, there's very there's subtle things that are being done that um, to nullify actual recoil, and if they can, you know, make some kind of way of detecting that particular thing that should level the playing field again because before it was more about the bigger obvious things that I need to wash my hands as well remember I don't want to get infected really you know I recognize this road but I still don't really sort of feel I know where it goes this map's changed an awful lot if we get to the stage and you need the original Chinaris like the back of the hand. Damn. I can see water over there. Let's go. This is towards the gunfire though, but this is what makes Daisy interesting. Stick my nose in. <laughs> yeah, it that sounds good. I think they're addressing, it looks like they're addressing more than just the people who go completely crazy. And the way you draw the line. 
it's easy for me to say uh, lo long ago um, like long ago during my uh, playing PUBG um, well I, c I can use this from way back with a Counter-Strike example I you know Counter-Strike went through the same thing had tons of cheaters on there. It was literally overwhelmed with cheaters. Uh, from 1.6 to half of it. it, was, it you had a lot of dedicated community members who would look at recordings and look at them with cheats on to be able to figure out when someone was looking through walls. There was a whole movement to try and stop that sort of thing. And I, I just found it's like... I played pretty well. And I'll go to like lands and play exceptional. And I used to scratch my head sometimes, you know. How the hell are you doing that sort of thing? I've... I've I've always been vanilla in that respect. I've, I've I've never gone to the extent of actually. Let I me mean, look at my mouse here. It actually has not such a dumb mouse anymore. It it has memory on there. It saves my profiles to the mouse. If you're very clever. You can save certain things to this mouse, including like uh, things that will completely stop the recoil of a weapon it's set to. So uh, I just where I'm pointing with this cursor now. It won't fly all over the place, or I won't have to sort of. You know, depending on what gun it is, out of the recoil and the shape, which is an art in itself. The people who master that, they go and play in these tournaments and they absolutely whoops up. But, um, you know, well, I, I guess that's really been the kind of, I feel, the, the last thing to try and stamp out. You know, if it's deemed something you shouldn't be doing, then hopefully it's, it's you know, something you detect to stamp out. But you see a lot of the time where, not all the time, but when you, you wonder what's going on when you can't see any recoil at all. You know, it's like it... That's... kind of you know there's... Something that's not looked for. It's more like something that's running on the mouse till you, you know, you set it. Always a cat and mouse game. But to me, I've always just run vanilla. The only thing I find the kit I'm most comfortable with is an interface. I try and get the um, my sensitivity settings where they are, the keyboard bindings where they are, and then I just try and you know find the guns that I like and you know look at what their recoil patterns is are by firing at a wall and practice countering it. And PUBG doesn't really have you know ridiculous recoil patterns. You would argue that CS recoil patterns are a funnier. You know, most of the time, um, PUBG's pretty reasonable. You don't. You'll see it, you know, if, if someone's streaming and they've got a camera on their hand, what they're doing with their mouse, you'll see when they fire a lot of these guns, especially if they, they've got them in, in auto-fire, you'll see their, their hand travel down the mouse. That's that down the pad, you know, pulling it down to counter that recoil. That, that's totally legit. Uh, interesting skill to master. That is actually a lot deader, it feels like, in playing control pad. Because you can set, um, depending on gaming, set dead zone and things like that, which actually. We have to, kinda. You don't. Mouse, mouse is different, like kettle of fish. Whoa, hold on. Let's get my uh, hands washed then. I'm not going to drink from here, though. No, 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 no. Oh, did they? I didn't know that. I mean, my, um... I use a uh, Logitech Pro wireless. And, uh... There's so much you can do with it in terms of settings and profiles and sensitivity, and I can just take it anywhere and it it retains that without having to install software. But when you've got, you know, the smallest bit of processing power and the ability to, um, you know, memory, um, peeps can get very inventive. Well, I suppose that's why in the end certain ones were... If that's... I, I've never... I've never heard of certain... That one's being um, 
and assist the player. I assume that's not like a banned player, but more like you've got a piece of hardware deemed not compatible. Please plug something else in. Right, I need to find food and keep her keep an ear out for some chickens. We hear that clucking. We need to uh, get them. Uh oh. I know it's more creepy like this, but I do love a kill feed in a server. <laughs> It's like you hear that shot and you're just thinking, well, are they actually going for players or are they just protecting themselves from the zombies? The only way you tell is to get close and see what's on the ground. First off, first off, um, I don't understand the software. First, I've heard of the actual uh, hardware ban. I think I'm going to alert this one anyway. But well, we might get, I suppose I should like try and kill some of them, you know. We might get a useful tin or two. Or nothing. Or nout. Try this one. Oh, well, he stuck his chem like there. Oh, zombies are traveling right light around this town as well. There's also the rules. I mean, what do they say? You know, in a perfect world, everything's level, but it's a bit like a piece of sporting equipment that comes out that, um, or, or let's say an update for your F1 car that's, you know, legal at the time it comes out, but then the governing body has to rule afterwards that it's... Uh, Something that they don't want this season or next season or something, you know. Or might like, remove it by, you know, three races, whatever they they deem fit. So it could very well be that without knowing it, that type of thing was seen to be kind of okay in the first few years of PUBG. Like, not something we're banning for yet, but we, you know, frown upon it or something and people just use it. It just happens. But if it is in the actual... You know, rules not to use anything on your mouse that, you know, potentially could do that then. There you go. Right, we're going to go down this way. Do you reckon we should ditch the... Oh, I can't ditch the chem light. It's too dark for stream. Let's get rid of this. Oh, this is a tough one. Oh, where did you come from? Wow. Still nothing. I tell you, these zombies are light on this vanilla. Not expecting them all to carry something, but something. You know, just something. Let me know that you can do that. Ah. That's handy. Love that for the sugar content. I think I've got a space in my stomach. Let's try it. You are, Bobby. Oh, skin swoops. They just haven't been too bad yet. That's all looted, though. It's all been turfed out. Yeah, I think this... Uh, what do you reckon of the stats of these things? The Is the physics in this game such that this actually gives me more overall protection? I'm headshot. So effective against them. And I learnt now that you can just, just run like right up to the zombies and take them on with this thing. You slash them so quick that it interrupts their attack. Take them down. 
but we're yet to find anything on these zombies. Really, really harsh. A wooden crate with 50 slots. Excellent for your base. Stick makes me look like I'm carrying a rifle. Good strat. Let's hope we have some keen eyed survivors out there who don't want to shoot on sight, but. Can we just start all over again? As much as I'm lit up with a Christmas tree, so hopefully they can. Who knows? You could end up within five meters of someone random. I like the look of these buildings up here. I believe we might be coming down to Chinaris now. Have I explored this high up in Chinaris before? Sure, but I'm not sure this version of the map. What's the fun in letting the computer or some other hardware do the gaming for you? I uh, have a hard time understanding people resorting to cheating. Yeah, you, know. you have a local game. Cool. Do it. Playing offline against bots. Yeah, it's cool. Whatever you want to do, you know. Cheating, cheat codes, whatever. They've been in games since the start. But the line has to be drawn, I think, when you've, you're competing against other players and a lot of other players it has to be protected that level playing field you know I don't understand it either because I, my gratification for a game would go to zero if if I was locally running something that was giving me an advantage and engagement or allowing me to see people through walls and all that it just completely takes the the actual um, takes everything out of the game. It pulls the core out of it for me. I mean, if I was to do that in a game, I'd probably play it for like sort of half an hour and it's be like, okay, this is great. Um, you know, easily killing people. Let's just, uh, let's just, you know, border the whole entire game. Done. Game over. When you don't use that stuff, then it's really never over. Because you're always looking, uh, trying to get better. Yeah, this is high risk where I'm at now. I guarantee you, usually, I wouldn't run with a chem light stuck to me like this. That's what I'd advise. Obvious reasons. Might be like a workable vehicle. Yeah, you go. Flashlight for a gun. All right. Ah, so you do have to open these in order to get to... Nice, some gloves. Good. Because I kind of figured that the tab would display everything. And it, it seemed to me like that. Those gloves didn't appear until I opened the door properly. Do these explode in the... Uh, end alone? I always use an armor too, I'd shoot him. Be able to hit him with like a... They took that out. Like that. Alright, store. You just wonder what the hell's going on there. Hello? Well, I try. Friendly, friendly. I'm going to cut this up for its, um... Should we use this knife, um... To cut meat? Does it make the rags dirty? Bloody knife now. Well used. They come out pristine. Bonus. Should we just stack these? But do they give you the chance of infection? Because they touch something dirty, that would be a true... 
contact surface. It's so weird at the moment. Um, thing about games is they take you out of most situations for a while and you forget. Which is the you know the benefit of taking that car this morning. Everything feels like so empty. Way more people around, you know. Sacrifice for the good people. Ourselves a real weapon now. <laughs> right, so I'm taking the hand. Now I'm gonna put that as three. Put it on the back. Three, five, seven rounds. Hmm. Better watch it though. We have no extra food. So no jog in it, but <laughs> what do you think? You think that's someone plomoing people down at the coast, or I think they're just going for record zombie count? Yes, sacrifice for the stream. Perfectly okay. Whoa. Hold on. Jumpsuit jacket that comes with 30 slots. I like this one though, so we're going to swap out. That's good though, we've got some nice stuff there. Damage rag we can use for fire lighter. Extra chem lights useful, so is the knife. Box of nails. Now, actually I'll have to open the box first. And I... Combine these, or do I need a hammer? Take that and the rope. Go for three and then drag over. Yeah. Cool. Didn't need the hammer. Or a crafting bench. Done. Now I have spiky baseball bat. Nailed bat. Is a matching jumpsuit. Keep this one. Can we use the paper as a uh, fire lighter? Yeah, use as kindling. Take it. And did I miss anything? I didn't check upstairs. But there is nothing. My guess is someone put that down there. Someone changed their top and left the stuff in it. I don't know that feeling. Good. It's been disinfected. for food yet. Actually, I haven't heard the chickens. I wonder if we, we get the likely to hear chickens around here. I suppose they can just turn up anyway. Usually I found around populated areas where people like to keep them. Zombie. Hmm, bit of my knife out for some reason.
They are just not dropping the tins, are they? How many have I got so far? I feel like I've taken about 10. 10 down, at least. Well, that. Slashing until dead. Paused. Hesitated. Probably makes this more visible. Oh, nothing in here. I don't like these. I, no, I like these buildings, but I don't like them for the reason that I never find anything, anything in them. Okay, start looking for signs as well in case we find uh, there's some bodies around or something. Zombies, people have been here. Did I just lose the knife? It broke? Yeah, ruined. Okay. In that case, we don't use that for combat anymore. We use the bat. I'm going to need that. What time is he? Observe time either. Check through these houses and then we'll head down to Main Town. Just a hat. See, I've seen stuff spawn everywhere, and I think definitely by the TV, on the cabinet. Check out this, see if we're lucky. It's not been opened. Um, I'd love to play that next weekend. If I get the option to, yes. Uh, my only problem is it's not on cloud service, so it depends if I have GPU. couple of hits then I really don't want infection thank you but we are well covered up I've got gloves this time I didn't have before god this this game wants me to start for sure we've long burnt through the whole entire chicken here come on you gotta you got tell me that one of these has got like <laughs> 
something on them. Give me the lemon. This is always an interesting place. Hello. Patch up that cut. Uh, I'm not panicking yet. But I am on the last chance saloon with the food source here. I am right, you can't eat zombies, so we're going to have to get lucky with something. I think I found slugs last time I was in one of these places. No doors open in this place at all. Very neat. Guessing that's just a zombie. Any suggestions? Tell me this guy's got something on him. Got some food, mate. He has not. Well, I'm on my last legs now. This is not good. We're not going anywhere fast. I'm unable to sustain myself again with food. I really don't think I've done a lot wrong this game, even less so I could be last time because let's check in here see if anyone's planted food. Call a chicken, ate it, started to move between towns. Uh, it's just not enough. It is not enough to sustain the travel, is it? Mm. The space shuttle landed on your head. What? The one that's been dangling there, the model one. Uh -oh. yeah, I came for the headshots that time. There's one. I kind of feel that the zombies are my only hope. I'm <laughs> the lack of resources in this mode is alarming. Got nothing. Mm. I know it's like because I badly need the very thing, you know, it's the very thing to survive. But I'm, I'm, an, I'm slightly annoyed because I've, I've built up a good character here. Mm. Just once if I drink the alcohol, is that going to help with the pain? Will that fill us up for long enough? Doubt it. Actually, saying that, some, some alcohol's got. Calorific. Mm. Yeah, look, look at my health state. 
I might as well just pick on myself with this thing and see what happens. Bottoms up. Oh man, look at that. Three stage down now. That's, 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 that's killed off everything in my stomach. We know now that I'd have to have something with like instant success. We sat there eating pumpkins in this state and it didn't save us. Oh, for that life. I mean, it's just annoying. Don't you feel that this is like too... I don't think we've had one game yet where I've come across many, many, you know, like lots of cans and stuff like that. It's always been... Hey, zombie. Now I've got the virus. Look at that. There is a chicken there, but there is no time. Wait a minute. I was ate it raw. I can't even get to it. God damn, things behind a wall. God damn, chickens behind a wall! Yeah, I. It's it's difficult. It's difficult to totally enjoy like this. I can't even. Well, look, if I'd run from place to place thinking that you cut down time, we would last less. Okay, the only reason why I'm lasting this long is because I'm moving, I'm moving slower. It's like you'd have to. Hell, I don't know if eating the raw chicken there would have done anything, apart from make us like violently sick. I ended up with a virus then as well. Alright, where are we? I can see something glowing over there, so let, let's see what's going on. That's someone's chem light. Oh, hey! Give me a kick. Yeah, it's... It's a recurring theme, though, running out of food. I mean, I even went to an apple orchard, which would say, okay, let's stock up on a few apples to get to the next town, right? That would do it. Can't find one on the floor. Is it like server restart, spawn three apples, and the first person who gets there just grabs them, and they don't come back, they don't gradually fall off? I had that yesterday. But that, that whole game is... The whole game right there was kind of... Well, maybe the server has actually restarted here, which might work out. Yeah, connection failed. I think it has restarted. Okay, we'll give it a minute here. In fact, I'm just going to grab a coffee. Give me two or three minutes. Um, we'll come back and try and uh, rejoin it. Awesome.
Mexico. That's a real bitter coffee. That was this. This is Daisy's new soundtrack. This was full up, this one. We're there in the queue. Lots of action to be had. If we just don't die of starvation. Maybe a little trollage of the coast is in order here. We'll spend a couple of lives just trying to... Uh, knock someone in the head with a... Take this stuff. Bandit. Bandit, bandit, bandit. I'm not sure of the name. I know that it was um, pretty much a full European one, which um, default vanilla, which had a good ping and was high pop. I'm not sure exactly which one. Uh, Kartik, welcome back. Just subscribed. Someone who's been there for a long time, many years. I don't know if he's around a chat, but just got a message. Checking my email to see if I've actually got any response from. Hmm. Nothing. Find that for that. Yeah, nothing from the GPU. Yeah, give them three days, that'll be Friday. They won't do with anything on the weekend, I know that, because I've tried uh, I tried on a Saturday to get in touch before. I feel like I need to call with the uh, the number to kind of see where the whole case is going and how it's being wrapped up, because at the moment, they, I don't think they have details of where to return it. Yeah, everything does. I mean, it's... Um, I'll have a look at these train cars. You would be burning through more calories when you're cold. Your body shivers to keep warm. And the more active you are, the more calories you'll burn through. Right, let's get this Ken thing popped. already I like open yeah <laughs> that's what they found right there All right, let's go towards the city not much going on but we'll stick by the road see what happens 
as in gunshots yet. I don't see any um, bodies on the road. In fact, there's not near zombies at the moment. Stay the course. Stay the course. Oh, we know this server's been restarted. Unlikely they've been all everyone been through. I mean, when a server restarts, does it keep the status of all the doors? Military tents. Yeah, here would probably be some popular lootage positions. Nothing on the table, and often you get something that's resting on top of the sandbags as well. But my priority right now is to procure some food. Where are these tents? Are they up here? Up this road. Is this a military position up here? We say military tents, do you mean like the roadblocks? Down the road I was on. Okay. ones. Three food sources in a row. Something like that. I think, well, okay, I'm probably good for the next 20 minutes now. <laughs> there is nothing. How you doing, Laura? Hmm. Hmm. Little bit of gunfire. Where we're going. Well, I was going there before, but... The calorie burn is so great that... Double yellow now. Like, damn it. I suppose I could try and save myself at this well. For a while. Drink until full, huh? Alright, let's go. Now I know what to look for, so we can keep going until stomach is virtually full. Let's take quite a few gulps, though. Alright, three cans of food. Uh, no, one tin of peaches, a can of sardines, and a plastic bottle. That's it. I'm done. And some beef jerky. <laughs> yeah, it's probably for the best, I think. 
Hey, you're lucky. How you doing? How are you doing? How, how, how? What's going on here? It's like I haven't even topped the bar out yet. Like a couple more stages here, am I not? The, the well running dry. So I'm jamming my finger down. Drink more, drink for oh no. Alright, there you go, we're, we're full now. There's a little stomach is expanding sign. Now it shows the speed up before we get too wet. Yeah, I did that before. It doesn't take too long to go away. When you just stop as soon as that, that comes up, it Seems that you absorb a bit on movement. A, a tire iron. Alright, just in case we need to trade for our life. Got something useful to. <laughs> it's, is it a good weapon? Alright, okay, I'll put it to slot one. Better be, well, it better be better than the saw. Or probably anything is. Right, where's this military? But is this down there? Where's this military area? I didn't grow up around a junkyard, no. Wait, wait a second. What? How's that relevant to right now? <laughs> I'm, I'm not connecting the dots there. Got to scrounge for stuff. Drenched. Oh man, this match is all drenched. We're getting cold here because I'm running too slow. A bomber jacket. Well, that's actually got to be better, isn't it? Uh, that's not the way you do it. Let's try. Let's put that into my hands and then double click. Is it right click? Wait, right, put it in hands. Is it right click? It's not. What the hell is going on with this, man? I'll do. Oh, yeah, I've got a plum. It's a worn plum. Take that. A oh, worn plum. Uh oh. Give us a little something, something. Oh boy. Oh, look, it's a pristine IV. We can now get ourselves salined in the hospital. Bravo. That'll wake us up. Oh, yes. I'll see you now. Oh, I don't know. 
That's not quite as good as the kitchen knife. In my opinion. Oh no, dirty rags. Let's make our first stop hospital if we find one. I think we might need some of that uh, anti-venom. Good job, those rags look disgusting, man. Now, you're actually right. I, I didn't, yeah. That is true. That plum did jack. Gotta make sure you get that headshot, that's all. I look up a bit and boom. I think it just works. Hold on. We are actually coming along to some civilization. Oh! They dropped something! I'm gonna farm like 2,000 zombies. They actually dropped something. They do drop something. It's okay. Uh, they actually drop... Wow. Okay, maybe they just have to be around major cities and they start dropping lots of stuff. Could be a restart, I guess. A third person. Bricked up, you see. But enterable. Totally. Right, we got the coat. How's the bomber jacket doing? It's not drenched or anything, so I think it's actually working as intended. Right, let's cut that up with a tire iron. See if we can... Okay, I was hopeful. We'll keep that, uh... That dress for... Bandages. I'm going to get this zombie as well, because I'm going for tin of tune here. Damn! Swing faster! What? Say what? <laughs> you, you, get, you get to the point where, actually, little things like this are little miracles. From what we've been through before. Don't you go playing on that server where this stuff's already available now. You just get too spoiled, these things are but now they matter. Everything means something, it doesn't matter how, you know... How insignificant it may seem, you're going to need it in this. That's probably bought us about 10 minutes. But at least the zombies are dropping stuff now. Plus one zombie drop script. Welcome to the industrial sector. Once a lively hub to transport various produce all over the world by container ship. Now it has been stopped dead with nobody left to run it but myself. Seeing as I have so, concentrate so much of my time I'm trying to find a bite to eat for now. Restoration of humanity is the last thing on my mind. Survival is the first. Is there an office up there or something could contain some good stuff. Oh yes, the la latrine. I certainly do. Everything was building up to the reopening and that was it. But nonetheless, we are in industrial, so I need to move to something a little bit more residential. We'll keep going here. Whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on, hold on. Surprisingly, 
that tin of tuna has actually given me back quite a bit. Okay, I think we've got at least 20 minutes now at this pace. Yeah, that, that's totally good enough. That's it's wonderful for car parts of it. Repairing a vehicle, this is the place you want to be. Wait, Capri pants, they look pretty worn. This worn soaked. I think we're probably we're only 20 slots though. And yeah, let's ring this out then. I don't want to lose slots. Make sure you don't crush anything in those pockets. There's quite a bit in there. Worst thing, isn't it? That damp clothes. I've been going for a jog, but hmm. Factory floor. I'm going to go have a look at this supply room just here. And we'll go into that kind of factory house and see if there's anything in there and then try and head for something residential. Plain nout. Ah, motorcycle helmet. Getting nearer to the party. So if I can find a Mosin in the Gant with a scope anywhere around here, you know. But I believe that's going to require a military base visit. Upstairs. Yes, we are close to Cherno. That was rubbish. <laughs> Didn't even find any rubbish. You know, we've got some... Oh, maybe we're very close to what's going on. Yeah, that's pretty big lag. And big lag. That close. I'm not sure the physics are right there. Oh man, and it's raining. Torture. A well hidden sniper. But wait a second, food has arrived. Nothing to cut it up with. Let's get the food. So you stay there. Let's find something we can cut it with. That's our lifeline right there. I'm never going to see like a sniper like that with a rifle and stuff. Not unless I was looking down a, a scope analyzing every section of the land. It, that actually happened before, though. It's like, um, 
If you hear the sound, it's close. It reverberated really close. But my death was a long time after. I just wondered if, if I'd actually heard that sound, if I'd moved at that point in time, I would have a chance. I just like sort of kept running. One shot. Took a long time to do anything and register there. Usually it would be like zip. Instead it was like two, three, zip. <clears throat> Must be just going for the head count anyway. I don't know if you can use them as some kind of firelight or whatever. But, or, uh, I don't know what the actual... If they have... I thought it was a corpse there. Does not have any um, burbers? Oh, look at this! An orchard. Mini orchard. Should be some food here, right? Eh? Like, go up to the... Hang on. What's happening here? I think I saw someone. Right. It. What? What? That was a player, but maybe they logged. Oh. That looks a little bonjour, no. Come, this guy. Alright, it looks naff, but that'll do. It's a coat. It is warm. Humanity in a lawless environment. What happened to the fun of the holdup? What happened to the element of risk? Sitting back there with a sniper rifle, just shooting people who don't even present a weapon, and realistically just trying to find something to eat. Okay, I'll give you say if the shoe was on the other foot, would I be sitting there sniping? Not likely. I probably would at least try and... Get some sort of interaction going. It's half the fun. say that I haven't contributed to that really because you know you play characters in the past like Dr. Hands you know and filling up several oil barrels with uh, <laughs> fresh human um, imagine a few people's positions on or that there's anyone friendly out there changed drastically seeing that. Can happen. Let's go see if we can meet anyone in town. Find the uh, water supply. I viz. I'm really going for it now.
Looks like I'm going to turn into the local council inspector. Who's just received a noise complaint from the neighbours and needs to enforce it on a heavily armed mob. With no backup, but it's going to try and convince them otherwise. How about that one? Oh, matches. Yeah, I just need to find a clipboard now, right? Make it look official. Got some nice shoes. They're very nice shoes. There we go, we're just going to do something about the trousers now. Let's eat this. Fantastic, there you go. Cold. Do need some better trousers. Yes, so I, I suppose I think going through the the peak of or the build and the peak of Daisy mod. A lot of us created stories that would suggest there was an incredible amount of cooperation and that in itself, that message in itself seem to have a great knock-on effect with people's tolerance in game wishing to promote the same kind of well, feeling within the game that actually sustained for a long time wow it's good it's like full of stuff well, that's an item i've not seen in the game before a loiter Hopefully it does just that. We've got some rubber slugs. That'd be nice with some crowd control from the council inspector. Council inspector that does have some backups. I think we'd have to go to the uh, police station. Oh, it's one. Have we got anything to open that up with yet? No. Tell me something, why have we not invented self-opening tins yet? We'll go through all that ha- okay, wait a second. That's quite recent. Shall we eat in peace for a second? And oh, I've got to really watch my back here. That is a recent body. Not often you come across fresh pears. Which is good for us, because we can actually now get to a point of have a little semi jog run around then my my stamina what why is my stamina like that is that because of the cold how do i get that stamina back i guess i'm new shoes in my shoes oh. hmm. the weight i'm carrying all these clothes Let's get rid of that. I mean, I've got a lot of slugs. Really? Let's put these on the floor and see what happens. Oh, yeah. Wow. Really, that that affected by the, yeah, it's it's exactly that. Why does I take like the high visibility vest off? Hey, 
Damn, can I drop on the ground, please? Yep. That's doing it as well. Well, I want that. Uh, the torch. Let's get rid of that as well. Guys, what the hell? 0.25 kilograms? So, these weighing at 0.5 kg. Let's just, uh, for the hell of it, take one out of the box and see what kind of ranges that could have. Yep, okay, true form, doesn't really make much difference. Is that because, is it more awkward in my, um... Control left quick, yeah, okay. I'm putting more stuff in my backpack. Ah, there it is. Got a crowbar in there. Of a massive four kilograms. Yep. So if I transfer the weight of stuff to the backpack, does this aid us at all? No. So it's a general weight. Alright, that's fine. And I'll keep that for fire lighter as well. Get rid of this. Alright, got some stamina back. Is there any way to... Um, I guess make me a little bit stronger? Hello? Anyone in today? Apart from you? Hmm. All I need is a shotgun now. Then it's game on. This one, three kilograms. Same. No real bad loss there. Looked like a million times better. I have to get some better trousers too. Both want. Now, I could have used that crowbar actually to yank open the tin of sardines. Remember where that is. That's in the shop in the ground. I know, I know which one down the road, so keep that in mind in case we need it. I hope I find a tin opener or something a little bit less messy.
open a door on someone and say hi and start hitting them. <laughs> Wait a second. A useful compass. Partially used chem light, so someone else was was here. Especially the clothing items out here. There. Wait, jumpsuit pants in pristine condition. Hold on. Worth the change, maybe? Or are they 20 slot? Yeah, they are, but... Um, they're actually heavier. But I think we need something that's a bit... Uh, this is way better condition. If I start going down the lines of... <laughs> not putting on, like, uh, proper clothing... Need to benefit from the warmth more than the the weight. Crisis said that earlier, actually. Open the, uh, you know, use the tins. We'll, we'll keep that in mind. Not exactly where it is. Hello? Any friendlies about? Hospital could be a good option next. See what we can find over the hill there. It's worth checking the store. And this one too. it inside and a backpack upgrade too so let's just hide in here a moment transfer our stuff space to stash some pumpkins. Let's gorge on a few of these beauties. That is what we're talking about. One in the police jacket. Actually, what am I going to cut them up with? Try and rationalize this. I reckon the crowbar would do it. <laughs> I wouldn't come back like, what? 
just to clarify, we can't eat these unless we prepare them, right? And what are they, like 2 kgs each? <laughs> the, the calorie burn alone carrying this stuff is a danger to my, my very existence. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Right, so we need uh, we need a knife, knife. Christine, let's change it over. A little less sweaty. Whoa! How oh, do you suddenly get the alerts? Got it going on. Probably because I'm running out of stamina. The light hits. Alright. No knife here. But. That. Is a kind member of the community. We've thought about that you see. Let's plant. Some food. In s oh, This thing's super heavy. But oh boy is it cool. Let's put it on. This this thing is like <laughs> I have lovely eyes. This this thing um <laughs> carrying so many died carrying ten pumpkins. He had all the food he ever needed, but he just could not lice to save his life. Yeah, so what I'm saying is, uh, does Crowbar have any chance of preparing slices of uh, of this stuff? Because I'll go back and grab it. We're still near the center of town. I mean, at least it opened the tin, right? At very least. Good. That's probably worth more to me than the visibility now. Stab proof vest. Does the stab proof vest have any um, ballistic stopping properties for like a pistol or a weapon, base weapon or anything like that? Like, does this helmet that I'm wearing have better deflection properties or like a small caliber round? Does it have any advantages? Because it is super heavy. Oh, there we go. Someone's arm to the teeth. I'd love to walk up and interview that player that's currently doing that right now and say, hey man, what drives you to do this? What drives you to sit there all day and snipe players with nothing all day? Not necessarily, but some players are not. Wouldn't you identify the heavily armed ones through that extra long range scope you've got? And have pity on the ones that got nothing. <laughs> Serious. I'll be like, that's just ridiculous because every player that I leave alive is a potential player to come back and hunt me down. I'm gonna teach them all this. Join this full server for a reason. It would help the shrapnel crash. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. What about the vest though? The stab proof vest? Does it have any... Does it have anything there at all? Right, I'm starting to run out, so I'm going to run back and get a crowbar. The very least we can do is op open the tin. No, not run. Walk. 
because I'm it will definitely buy us another 20 minutes minimum while we see what we can do about preparing this pumpkin nice some magazine 45 ACPs Territory been here before, but I didn't take the gloves last time or the belt. Hold on, is that damaged? But still usable. Okay. Cool condition the gloves in. They're yeah, pristine. Good, 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 good. Right, the crowbar should be in here. And it is. I'm going to attempt to yank open this tin with it. Now that body out there is starting to decay. That was quite fresh. It was quite fresh. Head to a different area. Oh, you know, I could... But I, I said a couple of rounds of action, you know. Or potential. You know, higher risk. Hey. Hey. The mighty crowbar. It actually works on pumpkins. Right, now that we're actually in kind of like good health... How much is this going to actually fill us up? Let's try it. Then we'll go back to that shop and we'll stash up. I love the way it makes the acoustic effect to the helmet. <laughs> makes you wonder how, he's actually, how she's managing that. Lots more. That's working for both hydration and... But the stomach's not full. Okay. Just chop the lot up then. Wonder when I talk in game if it will give me like an actual... Um, stick effect like I'm talking to someone through it. Point two five kilograms so yeah, it significantly uh, decreases its volume. You get like a couple of slices out of it. I mean, it it doesn't really give me that much, I don't think. It's a little bit. It needs to be cooked and prepared. Put down all of them. Heard you come by. I mean, you no know, harm. I'm simple survivor. Hello. How are you? This is probably going to get rough. Hey, survivor. Leading me 
to a trap, maybe. Hey! How you doing? Hmm. Well, I don't think that's one for meeting. Kind of felt that after a couple of seconds of doing the chase thing, but... Uh, I don't know if we should go crowbar to crowbar. That's powerful. Oh. Hello? How are you doing? I am friendly friendly. Actually, seriously friendly. You care to meet? And trade? Yeah, we've got damn, I'll tell you what. Neighbors here are edgy. Though that player did have a shotgun. I've got a lot of shotgun rounds. <laughs> My downside is I'm carrying so much stuff. Maybe if we stashed a couple of pumpkins in here. Do you reckon that, that weapon is actually loaded? We find out. Whoa! Scared me! Let's go! <sighs> it is loaded as well. Oh, holy hell. It was a good shot. Oh! Wow. Oh, damn. I got hit in the arm there. It's a bit of a, a shot to pull off of my movement speed, but okay. That's it. That was... Oh, damn this game, man. Well, I tried. And paid. Aimbot. <laughs> Thing is, um... Think of it like this. You run around and start to run up a stairs, turn around and sort of like move to the side. The latency involved probably means like on his screen, I'll just sit there and bang. But the hit zone was in the arm. I saw the actual like thing go splat. Now, I mean, Yeah, that's kind of, that's kind of a bit much, I think. I would have thought you would, you may start losing blood through the injury, but get flat out put down like that. It was not a headshot, it was not a full body shot. It was like, uh, let me check. Do this again. I want to know where he's actually hit me. Yeah, see, I run around the stairs and I hear him reload, so I'm guessing he's going to try and take another shot, so I quickly move in one direction and then change the other. What? Oh, you guys got to see this. No, that, that, that crap just don't wash. Uh, no, uh, you got... What the hell, man? No, you got what the what the hell? exactly what the hell? What? <laughs> Let me show you what I mean. Right. So in other words, I tried to use because uh, it doesn't seem to work that way this time. But I tried to use the um, the sort of the lag to give me a bit of advantage. So I made him miss. <laughs> I made him miss once. Right. It is loaded as well. Oh, holy. So he's, so he's, I can hear him reloading here. So I think to myself, okay, ma make him miss again and we can try and lunge in and get another hit. But have a look at the way this is. This is 
this is why combat is so just this game is like yeah. let's shut it up here oh. this is what I do I, I look out here he hasn't even looked down the barrel of the gun yet to aim right Good then shit. I start moving to the side look at this I don't think I was even standing there. It's just like being sniped earlier. There is such a massive latency. It's huge latency. Jesus, that feels like worse than the armor two days. It is consistent though. It's consistently large amount of latency. There's no 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 yes or no about it. It Hell man. to this server. I've got about 20. I'm telling you now, it is not my connection that's the problem here. Yeah, you're zombie with some loot. Double loot. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Oh, I'm okay. Oh, Do you have dang. a can opener? Uh, I, Jesus, I just got here. I got nothing. Have you yeah. tried using using the baseball bat? No. Sure. Uh, a stone or something. Yo, how's it going? Um, wait a second. Slow down, please. I need to translate. Uh, is this dude? Is this dude bothering you? Hey, buddy, is this dude bothering you? What the fuck is he saying? Uh, he says uh, you can have his shotgun if you hit him around the head hard enough. <laughs> what? What? How are you? Get him! And you can have some. Oh, him, not me. Oh, hello. Damn, I need something to put my hand like when I do. Just try the chem light, but drastic motion. Do. <laughs> that worked for someone else yesterday. What are you super doing with that? So far. Uh. Le Homa? Konnichiwa. <laughs> nice shot. Let's go. Oh, the D6 real. Chem light doesn't seem to do it really. It's getting about two hits to my one. It's a what the flipping out. That dude was hitting me about three times to my one. What is going on here? How can I be so desync from this game? He's punching away from me to behind, for God's sake. Let's get rid of that no, chem no, light. No, 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 no. Here, to the beans, man. Take my beans. Take my beans. Let's go again. This time I won't try the chem light trick. Don't, don't do it, man. This is the old star who used to jump off the edge trying to respawn. You know what I'm saying? 
It's not worth it. Are you punching up there? Hey. <coughs> we be friends now. Or I'll, I'll give you the cold, whatever you like. <laughs> I'll give you the cold for free, mate. Hey, that was clever. <laughs> it's, it's okay, I can save you. Don't worry. I'll be your hero. Uh, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not clean. <laughs> I'll take that just in case. How can we... How can we how can, oh, man. Actually, I uh, don't think... Uh, I don't think we could do much for this dude. <laughs> He's like his neck's on the, his head's on the wrong way. Um. Anyway, I could, let's eat something to recover from that. You do realise that we sneezed over the other dude as well. Blatantly, he's running down the road right now, and he's uh, <laughs> he's coming back for some for some meds. Anyway, let's see what is in this. How's the condition of this thing? Pristine. Is it loaded? Hell no. We need to find some shotgun shells. Ugh. But yeah, the, the, the desync thing is really difficult to deal with in this game. It, I'm not sure what that dude's seeing on his screen. But if you look at my screen, he's punching away from me, out the back of me. And... Getting a lot more hits in than me. We are in bandit land. I can clearly hear that. <laughs> I think we need to find running shoes if uh, the whole weight is playing into the uh, stamina situation. We, we, we need running shoes. And some shoddy shell. Look. I just got to get to hospital now. There is no other option. Oh, we need to get hospital and I need to find a knife. A crowbar, whatever. Just open this tin up to give us a bit of, uh, <coughs> bit of space. Crazy thing is, was I tried to save him? That dude was no help. Legged it. The preservation kicked in. I just wonder if we've got a turn. Did you think? Is it time? Is it time we properly turned to the dark side? Get some shoddy shells. And ninja the hell out of this game. Shooting everything that moves. Pretending we're friendly and giving it the boom shot. Slowly converting the friendly friendly, the diminishing friendly friendly player base and turning them all into bandits. We all end up that way at the end. Let's not tell a lie about this. Play the game one way and then end up in a vicious defensive stance or proactively ban the Tories. I mean, look at this. How the hell are we finding all this stuff now? Just need something to open it up with. If we do this, we'll protect everyone else from a. What? I'll do. <laughs> I do kind of have a bit of a head cold. How's it going? The man with no skills. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to run. I oh, shouldn't. I don't think I'm gonna have to. I'll leave the hospital as fast as possible. Looks like a very toxic server. Oh yes. Oh yes. Quite some distance away from the hospital. I'm, I'm uh, certainly not going to be able to take a round. But anyway, super surprised that, that that guy had what was quite a low caliber rifle for the game. And I'm just really surprised that I was in good health. Um, and just got like knocked straight down like that. There was no line of shot. It was just a complete... Whether the game interprets me running in that direction and changing direction, I'm still moving out here on this screen and then back. That's my best guess. Apart from having some sort of crazy, crazy aimbot, though, did miss the first shot. It's a hard thing to counter that, unless I just, I'll just do all this, you know. I need a knife. Stone knife's gone now. They like thing of the past stuff. <coughs> ah, perfect. No, you can't use a pipe to open the. Well, that's just that's wrong. Sure, you can make a hole with that. Oh, what was that? What's the bush? Can I? I can't like do it with a long stick. Can you use a long stick to open the can? Yes, my character does indeed have just that. <clears throat> This is the first time we've come across this absolute luxury of two full cans. Have a look at me and see if there's anything like crowbar. And we can't eat them. There we go. Wait. Ah, oh, yes. This will open up cans. Must do. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. The hacksaw. That'd be nice because you can like sort of work at that and get minimum metal filings in there. Tastes just good. Actually, no. Let's have let's have um, <coughs> let's have dinner and then dessert. This is this is a luxury for us. So these are both going. Kind of cool with baked beans are the cure for the common cold. That's it. Now we're actually going, despite being ill, we're kind of... Things are on the up. 
And then we'll go to the peaches. For dessert. can in your hand actually helps you in a boxing fight, is it? Well, now I know. People tend to use chem lights, and that didn't really work very well for me. It actually seemed to not work at all. Wait a second. How can I have, like, yellow food? Is that taking your... Oh, there we go. Okay. Good, good, good. Take a little while to process. But don't you rob me of my calories. I fly a tripod, seriously. Wait, there's something in the corner there, is it? Oh, can! Get a pipsy. Bottoms up. Alright, so we've had a, a full meal plus a drink. Look at that. One ninety nine. <laughs> right, we need to go to hospital. Let's go there by priority. We dealt with this. Bring it. <laughs> Physics. <coughs> All right, hospital. It looks like our health is now on downward slide. This is not good. We're succumbing to the cold. Whatever it is, the bug. Oh, no. Back up it goes. Oh, it must have just been from... Take an impact of the zombie. All right, let's get to the hospital. <laughs> Come on. Last time we found some antibiotics. Where is it? This is not it. Someone's just recently been in here and left a stick. Hello? Follow my voice. Let's go. Wow. We actually got it off on a staff member's former staff member at hospital. <laughs> Let's get that down as quick as possible. Not sure how many we need, but let's uh, one. Yeah, the symbols come up. Oh, look at that. How lucky was that? I'm so glad I shouted out now because we may never have engaged that zombie otherwise. <coughs> Gonna be sick for a little while, but at least the course is running through. All right, let's. Uh, Let's get into character now. Actually, a mask there too. Interesting. Need a backpack also. No, nope, that will go on instead of you. All 
right, and mask. Oh, we totally look the part. <laughs> Apart from the shotgun and the pipe. <laughs> I need some rounds. Does the mask actually work in this game as a protector to stop you spreading it to other people? Vice versa, like, less chance of catching it if they've got it. Does that actually work as a... I mean, description is obviously... Helps you remain unrecognized and... Offers some protection from airborne agents. destination. Everything is gone from here. Oh, we still need um, a few items of food and drink <coughs> and some shotgun shells. Medic pants. That sounds like our neck of the woods. Is medical. The better ones. Take a few zombies though. I'm like ridiculously lucky so far with them. shells if we can. Listen, if we get some shotgun shells, then we might as well make something happen. but there is truly nothing in it. I'll have a look upstairs of this one. Oh, could be a delivery hold on. Could be. Nothing. Um. Good 
Could be a building that spawns nothing. That's like a newer type to me. It's the last place we got all those slugs from. Read boxes and slugs. Just superstores around here. Got hospital, office complex. I'm gonna get this zombie. See if it's got anything on it. So I gotta keep up the course of antibiotics. Flashing. Better look at craning rags. Get some more of them and take another dose. Come on, you. How about some slogs? That's a good find, though. Need some backpack. Yes. to carry something in the backpack. Oh, I thought it was knocked out. You know. Right, it looks like we're cured. No more flu. It looks like that's just frozen. Nope. Please work. Oh. Yes, I will take you. Auto injector. Damaged first, damaged. Need needle and thread now. Those we could make, maybe. No, they're all. Are any of them pristine?
Oh, I've got nothing protecting my hands, and it's probably to do with what I'm wearing as well. It's easier to um, to get cut in this situation than having like a thicker jacket on. Well, that's what I'm keeping them. So that I can fix them and look damn good. That got cleaned up quick. So this way would be below to airfield. part of the city yet. Nope, we're going this way. More loot. It's not a bad run. I could definitely eke it out to a super run if I wasn't doing this sprinting like all the way around the place. It's not recommended on this mode. That's a pristine shirt, so I'm going to cut up for good wrecks. High quality stuff. I just want to find some ammo. And some ammo. Ammo and a sewing kit. Some canned tuna. Open up. Eventually, the dry spell editor. And we are full. Getting on for a full recovery. Um, I've gone over fences, yeah. 
I'm walls. I think you're probably talking about short walls like these ones in front of me. <laughs> they climb the sides of houses would be awesome. Good a weapon is the pen, uh, funny enough. Is it better than the uh, the pipe? Is it more focused damage? is active anymore. Canopy tent? Okay. And it has no slots. <laughs> I thought it was instant storage. I can't wait a minute, unless I'm looking the wrong way. I mean, I assumed it'd be like storage. What? Toggle opening. Look at this. Good night. Ah, only now does it pop. What, 150 slots? That's pretty decent. What the hell is making the noise over there? There's wildlife on that island? There's like, there's a moose over on that island or something. Get some new shoes. You're looking like wow. EMT elk is on that island. It'd be easier to chase down. Of this hotel, huh? Chinaris life. The dispensing area. Pose that. Some extra rags. Good idea. surprised how chilled out it is in this place. Any good loot on top of the clock tower? back of here. Back of the house. I think there is one behind here where the hospital is. Hold on. Thought I heard other footsteps. Let me take out the zombie. Oh, 
Ouch. Man, this is almost empty. Go docile there for a second. Cut me. Yeah. And past me, lost track. The character doesn't match. Perfect. But taking little hits like that isn't necessarily perfect. Morning, Sir Bruce. Happy Friday. Mark two, and that's the wrong clip for it. That's nine millimeter. We need twenty twos for this thing. Still, keep it just in case. Yep, all out of them. Is there a well by this? Just alert the zombie. Hm. Thought it found me. I was wondering if there were a well by this. That is really handy. Use that for rags later. Very professional, is it? L. Yep. We have a functioning torch. What I could do is I could use the saw on this to conceal it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's keep it concealed. See if it has any chance of saving our life. I saw the barrel off, we can fit it into the backpack. Now I put that here. Can you we launch it from the backpack? Yep, so I can go put it back there as well. Nice. Proper concealment. Seeing as we don't actually have any ammo for it at the moment, it's not really too much of a bother. But better if we can draw that out. They need it. <laughs> wow. Helmet protects zombie, right? drink. Although the temperature's dropping as well. No. Ooh. Pepper plant. Yeah. 
Yes, fresh food. Third movement. That's me, I think. Hmm. No shot that time. Odd. Okay. <sighs> no shot, just some kind of sound pop. Sound glitch. Nope, no shot. Right. Well, that wasn't a bad run. Again, that was also pretty boring for an ending there. Okay, so if that was a small if that was a small caliber weapon then that had to be close. Let's have a little look, see if we can figure out where that came from. Let's have a little nose. Took out that zombie there. Go now. I can see through the drink. So the temperature's dropping as well. No. Mm. I'm gonna look around, see if have anyone spot anything. Shout. I can almost see something there, but no, I don't think that is. The tree, no. Yes, fresh. Fresh food. I mean, I think someone would have to be quite close for that to work. Still not seeing anyone, that's certainly... From the left side over there. That's ridic that's stupid. No, it's ridiculous. Just don't believe it. You would definitely hear that. Hmm. Which bush? This this bush right here? 
right here. Or this one. I mean the path is kind of the path is kind of this way, right? Yeah, that'd have to be really sneaky. I mean there's someone in the ghillie suit. I, I can't see them. Uh rendering wise, I mean a few frames on, I can't even there, that's a brilliant view, in fact. So now we've actually got like a view from underneath and alongside. I, I don't see anyone there. You think there's someone in the middle of that bush? Well, that lines up with things, right? Or like I would say, the corner of the church. So I'm usually pretty good at spotting this stuff. Like at least movement anyway. It's, it'd be very difficult if someone's actually kind of just still and they look like a bush. But that bush looks too small now from this angle to cover someone. Hmm. I see even a change of angle doesn't reveal them if they kind of like glitch through it. I don't... Just trying to see where the stick out of that. It's here, right, isn't it? It's in line with this. I'll see as I turn around. They're not looking there or there yet. There, there. Got him. Balcony. Shit. Damn it, man. That's it there. Oh. I I re I didn't see that. I mean, it's so so I I understand I didn't see that. Bloody hell, man. CSI investigation. Right, let's just go back a few frames and see if we can see him. Sh like, now we know exactly where he is. Because that's the moment I get hit now. It's like, boom. All right, let's just see if we can see him just a little bit sooner on the way in. Yeah, it's fresh food. Yeah, maybe. Could be ducked down there. I can see something just a little bit there, but might might be just... Oh, no. Let's have a look. Oh, I think he is. I've just seen a weapon switch there, I think. I think he just seen like a, a weapon move. Yeah. Oh, whoever that is, make yourself known. <laughs> we would never know who's shot, no doubt, so. No kill feed. Ultimately, it just makes you wonder how long he's actually... He's, how long he's actually been there, and... Yeah. Uh, that's... Alright, uh, can we... And we can't zoom in there. Can we can we zoom in? I don't think we can zoom in. Because I think Okay, hold on. Let's go to full analysis here. We need to zoom in on this guy's face and find out who it is. Wait, hold on. Let me uh We got this. Capture this. Not. The bears.
and one who's got a motorbike engine connected to it. No, I'll say it's more like a lawn. It's not, it's not even like a motorbike. It's more like a lawnmower engine. Probably the same thing, like two strike. Uh, let's get this on. See if we can analyze. That dude is heavily geared. That dude has got, I think so, looks to me like he's got military gear on, I think. What's that on his head? What what the hell is that on his head? Hold on, let me just load it up there. I think I think we need to go. Yes, I am still here. I think I need to go to uh negative analysis here. That we're gonna we're gonna find out who this is. Removing the color, enhancing. Look at him. What is he wearing? What is that? I mean. That's just the edges. I mean, obviously he switched to his main gun, but it looks to me like he's got a military grade helmet on. That is a huge, that's like a large military backpack, right? He could be wearing clothing from his other victims. Yeah, it could very well be. Hell, we know that's not a position for future reference. I'm trying to see what else he's got. I mean, yeah, if it's a pure headshot, I guess you wouldn't really get the sound of it. But I'm, it just looks like he's got military stuff on, but I don't know what this thing is. Oh, like at the back of him there, it's like, um, has he got, is it? I, it's like almost like he's wearing the pan at the back there, but I, I don't I don't know. Look at that use sniper gas mask. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Well, I enjoyed that because I found the we could see who it was for once. Worth going over, I think. We're going to look for him. Hmm. Hmm. I'll see where we spawn. The problem is about trying to instantly get back is having the calories and the ability to do it. It's not really like you... Uh, I'm Electro, so... If... A Trek. I would have to... Uh... Get really lucky. And I doubt it's going to stay there forever. I do think the guy looks like he was geared, yeah. Fully geared. I th it, it looks to me like military Alice style backpack, maybe even the military version of this large one. I can't remember the name of it, but it's it's kind of a similar shape. Yeah. Maybe he may. Oh, wait a second. You don't think that object behind him was the spade. He dug that stuff and planted it there 
just wait for people to come along and take him out. I mean, there was no other bodies around there, so maybe I was just unlucky and... Because you can see that they stay along for, around for a while. I was just unlucky to be the first victim. Because if there'd been a body around there, around, then... Hang on, who's this? Hey! Zombie! Stop right there, you zombie! Hey! Survivor! What's up, man? How are Hi, you man. doing? Yeah, I'm doing just fine. Just got in here. We better get inside. Yeah, going? Quick. Yeah, we better run. Not good for a conversation out there. Whoa, they're hungry today. Yeah. What brings you round oh. to these parts oh, man, of Electra? Well, man, I just just got in the server. I'm just born here. You're born here. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Fair enough. I'm not born here. I'm born in Cherno. I was tending to my crops, my pepper crops, and someone sniped me. Yeah, same, man. I was just just walking down the street, and someone just gave me a shot. Although. I did have, uh, using my contacts, connected with the local uh, CSI yeah. network and managed to figure out where he is. Nice. So my, You're a part of some group, man? Or yeah, my, my journey of sweet revenge might include getting a sweet revenge. Oh. I understand. That depends if we make it there, of course, because oh, I, can, I, can, I can I can help you with one. Really? Okay. Maybe yeah. we're just the last two decent no, people I, I, on the I, I, server. I'm so eating him later. Yeah, don't like I, I this. Can't help myself. My first shoe. I mean, I'm kidding. I can't do that too. Oh, there's a lantern. Yeah, can I keep the crowbar? Oh, oh, you you want it? Oh, oh. I'm keeping it. Uh, no, hand. if you want to keep it, you can. Oh, that's no good. At least we can open cans now. Watch out, man! Incoming. Okay. I'll hit him with this. Nice combo. That's right. First, we need food and more of it. Yeah. You know where we can find it? Well, some zombies have tins, which we can use the. Uh, Use the crowbar to open it with. That happens. Yeah. Oh, it's just whatever we can get by with. Or this chicken will do, actually, yeah. if we cook it. Oh, a chicken. Yeah. Although I can't skin it. That's a uh, secondary problem. No, I can't skin it. Need a knife. Sure. Maybe we'll come back for it. Gosh. So what happened to you? You got oh, shot just have... at random? Or held up or what? Yeah. Well, I was just walking and yeah, the guy didn't say nothing. I just got killed. Yeah, there's a few quiet didn't ask what, what's your name, man? It's Flux. Flux. Yes. Yeah, nice Eight thing. zero. My name's Edgar. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet. You. Maybe we won't eat him. Seems like a good guy. All right. Well, I hate to say this, but I've been through here already, and there wasn't a lot. Well, maybe, maybe we find some, something. Oh, yeah, I know where we died. It was on the, the I know that there's some bodies. Actually, there's one here. There is some potential food and supplies if it hasn't been rinsed. 
in the police station. Need that. Let's take the chem lights. Just want Last a flashlight top. if we need. Just watch it around here. There's a few gun singers. You can see some bodies. Someone's been here recently because they haven't got flies. Something in here. Yes, here it is. No way. There's a body there. Yeah, check it. One second. Oh, already charged. AFK for a minute. Okay. Hello? No man, no! Relax, we're friendly, we're friendly. Keep calm, bro. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Where is he? He's dead. Alright. Oh, no, wait, one sec, one sec. Hold on, guys. Boy, yeah, family uh, sister came around there. That was a bit uh, awkward timing because I'm I'm at the front door and I can hear all of a sudden through my headphones. It's like, hey, hey, well, I'm we're friendly, and then all I can hear is chopping noises. So I run. <laughs> my sister's like at the door. I said, hold on a second, there's a crisis, and I ran in. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, got hit. This uh, that's annoying. That crowbar is usually pretty good, and. I definitely whacked him, but damn, I, I, I just can't, I'm so badly losing out in this game when it comes to the combat situation.
I, I can't get a good break with it, you know? It, it's just too desync for me to... Just my brain just doesn't seem to gel with whatever's going on. I don't know what they're seeing on the screen, but... Certainly their hits are more lethal than mine by miles. I mean, and, and usually the spade is the clumsiest thing ever. You know, because he would hit the walls and everything like that. And I could hear it, but... It, it was like my... Alright, now I'm starting... Yeah... Uh, BS. BS, man. Yeah, I think this is rubbish. Yeah, and they're so timid as well. Yeah, I think it's hacker. Should have been in those situations, you know. Heavily geared dude in the balcony. It makes you start to suspect the whole thing, you know. You guys suddenly pet, team up, and then all of a sudden there's a dude straight on us with a balaclava. I mean, you could technically be like invulnerable or something crazy um hey you come and speak to me what's the motivation here what is the motivation here Don't understand where you get to the point where you need to do this. Kind of likely, I guess. Hmm. So that's three different places that we've been like literally headshot from. Um, this has got to be a hacker. Maybe that's why I was getting booted and stuff. Well, got a wrong one. I believe these guys, I mean, you're just going to sit there and shoot everyone off the server and destroying the very community he sits in. The problem is that an individual like this just... Nasty. I hope for better. Hey, excuse me. I'm in need of medical attention. There seems to be Hi. a bit a bit of a wrong one on this server somewhere. Hello there. Hi. How's it going? Hello. hello guys. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Are you, what's up? Are you hello. barbecuing hello. this individual? Yeah, I think so. There's, the there seems to be some no. lunatic headshotting Don't everyone. Thrashing. I want to know who it is. Party, 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 uh, party, party. Uh, yeah, there's a guy given headshot in, in once again. Uh, I mean, just respawn, getting headshot. Yeah, that's it. Who's that one? Which one of you is it? It's not me, dude. Are you the sure? The guy giving headshot is again alive. <laughs> Yes, but he doesn't seem to have the balls to come face us, does he? 
we, we, we can regroup together and fuck this guy. Well, I think we need to give him a damn good talking to, man. As what, what's flipped his button to do this? <laughs> Gone off the deep end, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I spent like literally an hour surviving through the worst case hardcore vanilla mode that I'm thrown at by the developers. I mean, Jesus, man, what they're trying to do. Can't me find, too, me too. Can't find a can of... What are you throwing at me? Get the hell out of it, man. A rotten apple. <laughs> the... oh, this guy giving it a... And it only to get headshot from the balcony from someone fully geared who probably teleported there in the first place. So what ge what gives to this, man? Yeah. Um, How does this it's happen? It's up and too tight for me. What? There it is. That's the person right there. You hear that? I yeah, say... We use strength in numbers and charge him down. Make him eat this rotten apple. What do you reckon? You up for this? Or are we just going to stand around this dude's burning crotch? Yeah. What happened yeah. to this guy anyway? Making me hungry. It's gotta be one or the other. I mean, either he's gonna come for us or we go for him, you know? <coughs> you sick! Are you sick? This guy eating, uh, eating, All uh, right. human flesh, I think. You good, bro? No, he's sick, man. He's uh, got, he's got the virus. I'm, I'm... I am good, man. <laughs> you can have a piece. I'm gonna sit. Yes, I'm waiting for the inevitable. Ah, oh, shit. Crap. It's what raining. the hell else oh. could go wrong? Now I'm gonna catch a cold. All right, oh, who, who who wants to fight first? Then let's go. Let's battle royal this shizzle. All right, who's first fight? in? Yeah, yeah. You can referee, okay? You can referee. The the one who gets knocked out first. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa! He's not you as well. What a time, dude! Come on. Run, bro. Run. I was gonna say the one. Let's get him, man. That was cheating. The ref doesn't. That's the ref doesn't up, get yeah, dude, Get in there. Block him in. Don't get the balls to fight with. Uh, get him. Uh, come here, bro. Come here. Come here. I'm gonna fuck you up. Don't let him out. Oh, that, that Yo, works. come on. Come here. I'm gonna fuck you up. Stop. He's on the rooftop. Oh, What's this guy do it. That's right, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh shit. Get him! I said go for the legs. Go for the legs, the joints. Weak pot. Going now, <laughs> dude. Come on, man. You gotta face us. Actually, I'm bleeding out now. So <laughs> come on, be good. a man. Bro, go fuck him up. He's running to the docks, man. I think he's. I think he's leaving us. He just chased chucking everything off. <laughs> Come on, mate! I need the bandage. Hey, man, he's, he's a slippery one, this guy. I thought it best to see this one. Well, dude. 
Might as well take the helmet, you know, in case he comes back. You need some rags? Yeah, some, thank you. I'm in good shape now. He's only given me the virus. You see what I mean by this, just this crazy desync mess of just dust. Where is he? Back of the fire. He's over in it. Oh, look, 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 look what I'm doing. Get off my brother! That's my pa! And my brother. I stop, it. stop, 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 please, okay? Okay, calm down, calm down. Calm down. I'm, I'm bad, I'm bad, I'm bad. Sorry. You know, dude, I'm sorry. I'm going to give you back your helmet. How about that? He's not sorry at all! Look at him! In fact, I'm going to hit him with it. <laughs> <laughs> that hurt. I heard him scream. We're gonna fuck you up, dude. That's it, keep it on him. Am I out of blood? <laughs> yeah. Keep the pressure on, man. To grind him down. We've got much blood to lose. On the upside, it seems that my health is going up. My blood is going down. <laughs> Alright, let's get this in hand and see if we can uh, finish him. I can s are they still up there? Where'd he go? The hell did they get to? Did you get him? Maybe we'll never know. Hopefully we'll be back. Let's get near the warmth. Oops. Well, yeah, that kind of, I guess, happens without the blood. Oh! What's up, Zeno? That's a bit of fun action, though. But I just, I can't get on with the desync. I, I just, it is my Achilles heel in this game. It's, I don't gel with it. And I think that fainting is probably going to be the theme. With this much blood. <laughs> We're so dead. That's so dead. I, I mean, it, it's actually on the up, but this takes some time. This takes some painful time. Hello, how you doing? You right? Nice to meet you. Hang on. You got my helmet on! Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, how are things going with you? I, I mean, I'm a little low. You get him? Did you kill him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Alright, see you in a minute. I'm just gonna nap. <laughs> Can you still hear me? Oh, looks like I can't talk when I'm dead. <laughs> uh, I mean. Come on, save oh. me. I, I, I'm out of blood. Yeah, you don't happen to have any... Uh... Who's this? Hey. How's it going, man? Uh, could I borrow your fat, please? I, I need a bit of uh, nutritious... What you left? Yeah. 
Hang on, you do, do you recognise that dude? That's the same Matt. That's the dude. Yeah. <laughs> 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 How the hell did he get back? <laughs> Was he dead? Or did he faint? Now we Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Well done to you. Fuck you. Now you see, let's look at that last piece of action there. Did you notice I got a rather good headshot punch? It's like nothing. Smash the helmet into the guy who hit him multiple times. Don't get on with this desync. Who's this? Hello? How are you doing? I like my situation here. Oh yes, I can tell. I couldn't read it either when I first started here. Then all of a sudden you you look up. You're looking up on the internet, aren't you? That's, that's fair enough. I did that too. It's just it's the way they write the letters out here. It's ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, they took C O, did something to N. H E T Y is Y backwards. I can work that out either. There's the B as well in the end. I mean, it's like they're trying to deliberately confuse me. You know? Well, this is Con Heya Bin. Con Heya Bin. Bullet Bin for short. You're still on Google, aren't you? Still looking at that map, trying to trace your way there. What it's like to be a new survivor in this game. That vanilla feeling where you just have no clue where you are. I still don't, years later, actually. They keep changing things around here. Let me tell you this one thing over anything. That's right. The problem is in this game is you start off with very, very little. Just a plum, actually. Fourth time, that me. I don't know, man. I'm beginning, beginning to worry about you. Got any food? Getting a bit hungry, staying around here. All right, let's test this connection shizzle. See what happens. Let's get free punch on his chin. Oh. Hey, how's it going? How are you doing? You right? You. This, this is my buddy. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're, ju we're just trying to. Just can you wanted. help us? Can you help us? We can't work out where we are. Try. We're trying to read this sign and trying to work out where we are, but not have much luck. Well, the reception is really bad around here. So I'm not Russian, but I would say What? I don't know. Hold on, let me just ask my friend. Do you think that's correct? Yeah, but which way should we go? You are new, new to the game? Yes, extremely. So that's why I can't help you. I'm new too. 
Hey. Only no battle royale. Let's go. Fight for survival. One, two, punch. What is this de sinky mess? No, that's that's below the belt. Let's not get him. I tell you what, whoever wins this can eat him. He's the prize. Good. You know, do what whatever. Where are you going? It's not over. I don't want to die. That's the last person standing. That was sneaky. See what you're trying there. All this for a plum. I'm hungry. Why prolong the inevitable? Look at this, he's just jumped off the edge. <laughs> It's popular, this place. Mm. <laughs> Look, I'm telling you now, absolutely no luck with this system, man. It's like, what the hell? <laughs> oh! Got one. I'm going to enjoy this pet. Oink. So, I don't know if you can hear me down there. They say if you talk, it helps. So in this case, I could let you live. I look still breathing, isn't it? I did not say you could get up. <laughs> what? Oh, hang on. Oh, hold on. Yeah, that's done it. Thank you very much. Anyway. So where were we? Yeah, but you see how many hits it took? That's crazy. You should get, like, knocked out in one or something. Let's test this with a still opponent here, so... Anything good on this guy? Oh, we got an apple. Good. I'm very busy here all of a sudden. What a place to spawn, but it doesn't it doesn't stop. They, this has always been the place that people have just jumped off that edge to respawn somewhere else. Always been the place. When there any peeps down there, they might actually get some uh, food. There's one. Oh, it's damaged, but it's still good. Anyone else? Apart from being pretty wet, things are okay. Oh yeah, seriously cold. 
this ain't gonna work for long. I need to create a fire. I think this is worth uh, pursuing unless I stand there and ring stuff up. There's, there's, there's actually nowhere to go here without getting drenched. it would probably work. And the run is long, so that is why most people want to just jump off the edge there. <laughs> <clears throat> I didn't have any cuffs or anything, so it's, it's pretty useless when it comes to uh, trying to hold them up. Ah, oh, God, this is miles. Miles and miles and miles and miles and miles. Anyway. I've had a pretty good time today. I think, um... I think it's been quite productive. We've fallen into the, uh, the food trap. Survived probably, you know, one of the longest stints. Especially with uh, running into uh, the cities, and yeah, that was uh, that was rough. And I can't leg it across there. I'd have to jog. Temperature's going to drop. Life's going to go down. And I think ahead of us here, I've got nothing to cut for wood. If we run down here, I'm going to going to be a, some houses. But man. I don't think there's going to be enough to support us to go down to the coast. Never say never, but... <laughs> Doesn't take long to find a body. Hello? That's a good pair. Apple. <laughs> pair. Wow. Well, that's giving us a little something. I'll just then. Um Uh, my doubts. And again, there's enough corpses on the way. I suppose I could uh, technically... Zombies might provide us with something. Yes, cut. Oh, wow. Okay. Heal the wound. Loot the corpses. Hope for the best. Oh. oh, 
can't seem to get that affected. Oh! And that's a ruined M light. Chain of food continues. got anything on it but it keeps taking me to fireplace I don't think we're ever going to know do you? don't mind if I do Serious. So many bodies. Now, my health state is still dropping. I imagine that's because my temperature is pretty bad. Wait, that shows us drenched. the way up. Have you got yeah. uh, any food by any chance? Good Maybe. sir. Let me check Stand. your pills. Let me check your pills. Stand come here, come from here. Me now. I uh, don't you have know if you are infected. You've Do not come pills. near me. Sir. You try to be funny, sir, but you I take you pills. down now. Sir. You don't want sir, me to I go must check your pills. Hold on. Stand still. Would you please stand still, sir? Stand still. You check my what? Stop bothering me. You think pills. it's funny? Is it not oh, funny? I think you're gonna die. Look at your face. Look how old you sound. You're not that old. No, not really. Now you're following me. Go the other way then. Come on. Sir, I do not understand what you mean. If you have food, please give it to me. No. I do not have any food for you. Well then, go the other way. Bye. But I will bring the elite troops in to take you down. You want to take me down? You want to well, try it? Yeah, let's go, champ. Combat 101. I'll put this chem light in the middle and we can fight each other over it. Ready? That's right. This is the center right here. I draw the line. Let's go. Do you have the balls, man? I'm not gonna fight you, but... Why? Why? Because I'm dying already, man. They're I good. They're gross, summer. Let's go, chat. My friends are almost here. Nope, nope. Oh, okay. My friends are almost here. I'm gonna wait for them. You mind if I meet them? Can we be friends? You wanna join? Yeah. Hmm. What the hell is all this meat? I haven't got much health left, so it's worth it to me. <sighs> it's 
soften him up a bit. What's he got? Oh, no food! Ugh! Never mind. It's alright. Your friends can come pick you up later. I'm off. This is like the people highway around here. Oh, hold on. Hey. The sad fact of the matter is. Hello. I need help. I was raided on the road. That's a zombie, right? Hello, zombie. I need help. Right on the road. You got tin peaches. Yes, you have got tin peaches. Okay. Not, not to the pictures, but I'll do for the warmth. I didn't think we'd make it to the next town anyway. I have my doubts now, but we are starting to gain health. It's just uh, a regular supply of food. The bumpers back up. Bring these out also. You're right, Mike. How are you doing? I actually should change my t-shirt and my appearance. The the hat's different. But I might get uh, done with some mistaken identity. The thing is, at the moment, I'm using, like, a lot of calories just to bring my life back. And it's really... I don't think it's uh, around from here, but... Uh, no. Mucho gusto. How you doing? Do you have food? Would I have food? I need food. Well, this is a standoff. Well, oh, the end of days are here. in a bad run. Managed to total a couple of peeps and and one staring at a road sign, so that's the way it goes. Very, very random. Alright, I think that's me done for today at this game. I've enjoyed it though. More than other sessions, but something about the combat, I just can't. I can't. I can't. I have problems grasping it. It's just so. How can I say it? You don't really get that feeling that the server is running at about 10 FPS. I suppose if you had a, like a someone 
you know, bending over a pepper or something like that. It's like, you get that shot. <laughs> An overall pretty good day. I, um, I thank the other players for that experience. It was, uh, a unique one near the end there as we were in kind of, uh, player central. Have a great Friday, everyone. I'll see you next week.